you are a help desk person or you're trying to get into a systems administration and you're still thinking that there's going to be a lot of hardware stuff that I need to learn and you're not focusing on cloud so then let me give you some reality right here this used to be a hardware sands and everything this used to be a hardware we got some new stuff and now only few servers remain and look at that oh my god gone everything gone so this video is not to scare you uh, about learning something new right now I've been basically warning people that if you are in a help desk or trying to get trying to get into IT as a support level positions, uh, then you should consider uh, like you know making your uh, future career goal in in cloud. Basically, what I'm talking about that is that learn more about you know Azure, Microsoft, or AWS, IBM Cloud, and stuff like that because a lot of these applications are moving. Now this is not to scare people who are trying to get into career because still you see behind me uh, we're still using a lot of desktops a lot of stuff like that but even those desktops are now connected to the cloud applications like Office 365 is a perfect example how it took over the email market I mean from the beginning Microsoft was leading in exchange area but now even people are dumping their exchange servers and moving to the cloud because it's so easy so easy to manage why wouldn't people do that you know people look into easy stuff and they want to and get more better systems secure you know so think about that because I just showed you example that's just how data centers are shrinking even in small offices big offices corporate world they're shrinking their da uh, data centers so if you are one of those type of people that you think you're just gonna be doing help desk and then move up to sysadmin positions by just doing hardware stuff then Remember, after five years, you may even be uh, you will be struggling even finding a job in this area. So even if, if people who are already in IT, my suggestion to you is this: that get on Azure or get on AWS right now, because you don't want to wait now. There's too much information out there. There are too many trainings out there. Um, there are uh, free trainings from Microsoft that are available from their documentation at least start learning about it or get into Office 365 and learn how they have set up this whole environment because both are connected to our real environments these days so that's a perfect example an easy example for, for, for people to start thinking about cloud and that's what we do in our training our entry level IT support training we don't teach about hardware stuff like that we give them testout.com they can actually go and you know check all the hardware pictures and kind of play around with that kind of stuff but we actually teach real Office 365 training real deployments training how does all the whole thing works on the internet and everything and another thing I want to talk about is that you know what I'll talk about this in another video because I want to talk about this how help this career is changing into more cloud type of support and I'm pretty happy about that some people are scared that oh we're gonna lose their jobs there's gonna be no more help desk no 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 it's actually getting better watch my next video because in that I'll tell you how the help desk overall thinking about help desk people like you know 10 years ago people were like ah oh, that's a help desk you know too much stress and stuff like that because it was too much stress all this hardware needs to be managed people had to do a lot of manual stuff but with the cloud and with the more advanced technologies this position became very much in demand and kind of like it's a fun position some places now some people still complain because they still haven't moved to cloud or they have not they're not utilizing the new uh, you know technologies and everything but in my next video I'll tell you why this position in future is gonna be a great position because we're gonna have cloud type of support and they are already paying people more and one of the examples is that go to uh, check indeed.com and look into these positions where it says office 365 support positions these days they're coming out there are very new positions but look at the amount of payment they're paying people and it's totally different than the mentality of oh that's a help this position so as soon as we talk about help this the money goes drop so now we're gonna talk about support in cloud the money is gonna go up so I'm really happy about that I mean I'll explain to you in my next video why this is gonna change and why I'm pushing people because I've been seeing this stuff for past five years we have developed people from nothing to IT professionals and they are now working in a companies where they're telling us guys we're moving to Azure Active Directory I, I need to learn about that I'm, I'm doing a lot of on AWS kind of stuff. I, I'm, I'm touching those stuff. You know, I'm, I might not know about it, but I'm actually touching it. But this is not to scare people who want to get into IT now. Still, you have time. Right now, just learn about it because companies are not going to hire you based on your cloud knowledge at this point. 
they will still need to know do you know deployments do you know imaging do you know active directory do you know ticketing do you know office 365 do you know how to track emails do you know how to troubleshoot windows 10 operating system that's going to be the main case still but slowly slowly it's moving because we have to think we're we're learning platform we're teaching platform we have to think ahead you know and our courses needs to be also designed in that way so that our members are up to date so that's why I wanted to share this video with you just a little bit show you that reality that in the beginning of that video that hey things are getting real and if you're not taking steps right now um, then I don't know I mean it's your choice right thank you